Welcome to our architecture study channel. Explore innovative designs, sustainability, and the art of building. Join us in unraveling the world of architecture, earth air tunnels, eats, are no longer a fringe concept in the realm of sustainable architecture. They're rapidly transitioning into mainstream climate control solutions, captivating the hearts of architects, engineers, and environmentally conscious individuals alike. By harnessing the Earth's remarkable thermal stability below the surface, EATS offer a plethora of advantages, making them a compelling alternative to conventional HVAC systems. Principle of Earth-Air Tunnel It is a technique that is used to generate cool air in the summer and hot air in the winter. The process involves moving the outside air through a duct system that is installed deep inside the Earth's surface. Because of the Earth's constant temperature throughout the year, it exchanges heat while passing through the ductwork. During summer, when the outside temperature reaches 35 degrees during the summer, the air that is passed through the Earth's surface, which is 10 degrees cooler than the outside temperature, absorbs the heat and transfers the cool air inside the building. During winter, when the outside air reaches 6 degrees, the process continues and converts the outside air from 6 degrees to 16 degrees. The temperature change provides comfort to the user, and this temperature can be further brought down by other engineering controls. Installation Process Site Assessment Analyze soil type, climate data, and building requirements to determine optimal pipe length, diameter, and layout. Excavation Dig trenches for the pipe network at the desired depth and width. Pipe laying, install pipes, HDPE, PVC, or concrete, with proper connections and insulation. Backfilling, refill the trenches, ensuring proper drainage and compaction. Connection, connect the pipes to the building's ventilation system and air intake slash exhaust points. Testing and commissioning, test for leaks, airflow, and thermal performance. Working of the Earth's Air Tunnel Air intake, outdoor air enters through a vent or wind catcher, the depth of the tunnel should be more than 2m or between 3m and 4m. Underground heat exchange, air flows through the buried pipes, exchanging heat with the surrounding soil. Preconditioning, pre-cooled or preheated air exits the pipes. Building integration, air enters the building's ventilation system. Optional supplemental heating slash cooling. While the recommended depth for EATS is generally 3 to 6 meters, the ideal placement depends on climate, soil type, and water table. The Earth's temperature gradually decreases with depth, but within this range, variations have minimal impact on performance. Remember, consulting an engineer is key for optimal design and depth selection. Design Parameters Duct Slash Pipe Length Longer pipes generally lead to better heat exchange, especially in winter. Optimal lengths vary based on climate and soil properties. Diameter of the pipe, larger diameters allow for higher airflow rates but increase cost. Typical range is 3 to 30 inches. Airflow, required airflow depends on building size and desired cooling slash heating capacity. Material of the pipe, HDPE, PVC, and concrete are common choices, with varying cost, durability, and thermal conductivity considerations. Duct layout, open-loop systems offer high heat exchange but require air filtration, while closed-loop systems provide cleaner air but might need longer pipes. Spiral and vertical configurations are also employed. Classification of EAT heat exchangers. Closed-loop, air circulates in a sealed loop, preventing contamination. Open loop, air directly interacts with the soil, requiring filtration for dust and pollen control. Applications Residential buildings Office buildings Schools Hospitals Industrial facilities Advantages Energy efficiency, reduces HVAC energy consumption by 15 to 30 percent. Cost effective, long lifespan, 20 to 30 years, and low maintenance costs. Environmentally friendly, lowers greenhouse gas emissions. Improved air quality, can filter dust and pollen, closed-loop systems. Disadvantages. Initial cost, 
higher than conventional HVAC systems. Limited applicability, not suitable for extreme climates or rocky slash wet soil. Space requirement, need sufficient underground space for pipe network. Maintenance, periodic cleaning and inspections are necessary. Considerations for installation. Climate data. Soil type and properties. Building size and requirements. Budget and space limitations. In conclusion, Earth Air Tunnels, EATS, offer a sustainable alternative to traditional HVAC systems, enhancing energy efficiency and reducing environmental impact. Despite initial costs and limitations, their long-term benefits make them a viable choice for conscientious construction projects. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Your support is appreciated. Thank you for being part of our community and journey.